Hey everyone, this is a video about replacing a hard drive in the Synology NAS unit. The scenario is that our hard drive has failed. You have uh, uh, one disk or protection on there, meaning one can fail and the system won't crash. So that's what I'm doing here. This model happens to be the 1511, an older model, but the operating system is as of 2006 the same. So all you need to do if you have the one disk failure uh, method, you can pull any of the disks out at, uh, at one time, one disk only, right? So I pulled out uh, the first one here and you just take it apart. It's gonna usually beep the, the NAS. This 1511 has screws that you have to undo here. So let me just unscrew it here. All right, so you get all the screws out. It just pops off like this. You put in the new drive into the frame and you put the four screws back in and you slide it back into the NAS. Okay, putting it into the NAS device here. It's going to continue to beep for a while. And what you want to do at this stage, you put it in, make sure it's securely locked there. And the goal at this step is to make sure that other, the green light for that drive comes on. I'm pointing at right there. So you can see there's four drives in there right now, lit up. You want the fifth dr drive that you just replaced, that green light to come on. So that is success, as you can see right there. And now it's time to edit the software, change the software. All right, so continuing with the video around how to replace uh, a, a drive in your Synology NAS server, what you do is now you log into the NAS device itself. You will get an error message saying that your volume is degraded. Uh, one or more vo volumes, disk groups, caches are degraded. Replace failing drives with healthy ones. So I pulled out the very first one, if you remember, and it's saying unused, so it doesn't recognize my disk yet. So I'm going to go to the hard drive uh, section, and it says disk one not initialized. And what I'm going to do is go to a volume where you also see more um, information about the space degraded. What you want to do is you want to go to manage, you want to go to repair. It's going to say disk number one is available to help with that repair. <laughs> And you just hit next and all the data will be deleted. Yes, double check that it is disk one that you want to do. And post repair, uh, it'll say I have a little bit more storage. Well, I think it just needs to repair first. So you hit apply and it usually takes several hours if not uh, days, depending on how much storage you have on here, how many disks. Um, I have another Synology device that has uh, 12 total drives and it, it, can take, it can take a long time, several days to do this, which is kind of a drag, but it's stable. You can still use it. Don't pull out, it, pull out any other disks but um, pretty stable device. That's it, folks. Thanks.